The Jewish Museum of Florida, FIU, is unique in that it's the only place that collects, documents, preserves, and interprets Florida Jewish history. The museum is housed in two interconnected historic buildings that once served as the first Orthodox synagogue in Miami Beach, Congregation Beth Jacob. The main building was designed by Art Deco architect Henry Hohauser in 1936 and is believed to be among the first buildings he designed in Miami. Throughout his career, he created more than 300 buildings in Miami, including the Colony, the Essex House Hotel, and many others in South Beach's Art Deco district. The Jewish Museum building was unique in that it integrated both the Art Deco style with Jewish symbolism. Hohauser's touch can be seen across the interior and exterior of the building. The chandeliers suspended in the sanctuary are typical of the Art Deco style and incorporate ornamental stars of David. Similarly, on the facade of the building, we see colorful Art Deco friezes in pastel tones, centering the Star of David among palms and a frozen fountain, both symbols of eternal life and imagery typical to the Art Deco style. While Hohauser served as the architect for the building, the then rabbi of the congregation, Rabbi Moses Meshelov, had a heavy hand in the design of the building. Today, our building boasts 80 stained glass windows, which were installed in the building in the early 1940s. The building was originally erected in 1936, as the Jewish community had outgrown the original sanctuary space. The finished building had transparent glass windows that could be opened year-round, providing air circulation and cooling the space, given Florida's hot and humid climate. When air conditioning was installed in the early 1940s, Rabbi Meshelov designed and commissioned 80 stained glass windows for the sanctuary. They were all produced locally in a glass factory right here in Miami. In designing the windows, Rabbi Meshelov included several reoccurring symbols and imagery referring to Jewish holidays, important objects, and zodiac signs. Each window incorporated a Star of David and Rose of Sharon. On the top row of windows, every design features one symbol at its center tied to a certain value, teaching, or holiday. This one, for instance, incorporates an oil lamp, a symbol tied to Hanukkah. Another represents the shofar, an instrument made from a ram's horn used during the high holidays. In looking closely at the windows, you may also notice certain symbols from the zodiac, a scorpion for Scorpio, a scale for Libra, a bow and arrow for Sagittarius, among others. These astrological symbols correspond to the 12 tribes of Israel. For more information on this historic building, you can visit jmoff.fiu.edu.